with Falcon Volleyball Coach and Patty. The Falcons finished WIAC play this week. Uh, team lost a three-set to nothing match at Platteville on Friday, but came back for a three nothing win at Lacrosse on Saturday. And then yesterday at the Cargus Center, beat Stout three to one. Your thoughts about those three matches? Yeah, um, obviously we're we're in the right position. We we came out of the conference five and three. Um, it's tough to play on the road, so you walk away with a split. And I think you can be very uh, confident that you've kind of done your task there. Um, and last night's match was just a great match between two really good teams. Patty, last week, uh, middle hitter freshman Erin Green was named the team's player of the week. She had 17 kills and hit 481 at Lacrosse and Platteville. Can you talk about Erin's play a little bit? Yeah, Erin is uh, merging as a really tough player. Um, she doesn't get the ball very often, but what she does with the ball, she is very impactful. And I think we've noticed that over time, but the last uh, few matches, she's just really coming into her own. Patty, you mentioned the uh, Falcons finished 5-3 and three in conference play. Um, you know, at the start of the year, did you set a goal? You know, your thoughts about finishing 5-3 yeah. and three in the league? Well, I knew at the beginning of the year that we would have a good shot um, at finishing in the top half of the conference. We have a great core in those three seniors, Andrea, Kelsey, and Gina. Um, they've done everything in their power to lead this young team, and I think some of those dividends are coming um, right along with that. Uh, we... Um, we finished five and three. I think it's a remarkable turnaround from a year ago, um, and we're still eager to play more volleyball. Patty, we just found out that uh, the matchups have been set. Uh, the Falcons will go to Eau Claire in the first round of the playoffs. I think it's November 3rd. Um, I know that's a little ways away, uh, far ahead, but your thoughts about the matchup there? Yeah, I think it's a you know it's a good rivalry. It's a good matchup. You've got two very good teams that are playing good volleyball. Um, we went five with them at Eau Claire. We're familiar with their facility um, and with that routine. So um, I think you'll find a very good match that weekend too. Petty, um, last weekend, Anna Schmidt Moss, a name out of the past for the Falcons, was it was inducted into the UW River Falls Athletic Hall of Fame. She's a great player for us for the Falcons. I think it was in the mid '90s. Your thoughts about Anna and, and, and her being inducted? Yeah, I think it's a great honor for Anna. She um, maybe didn't get a lot of the, the highlighted awards in her career, but um, when you look at the nature of her um, position and what she did for our program, she really established a foundation for, for me and for our program of what it looks like to be a quality outside hitter. She did everything um, you could do, and there's a lot of players in our program that are prototypes of Anna um, as far as their statistical output. And Anna held on to a lot of records. Um, they're just now recently getting broke by uh, Kelsey Sheely and a few others that have had good, solid careers. But she's, she had a great career. Um, she has a great professional career right now with her coaching and teaching and administration. So I'm just really proud of her and all of her accomplishments that she's had. Well, congratulations to Anna. Patty, looking ahead to this week, and the Falcons are at the Eau Claire Tourney, tourney play two games on Friday, two games on Saturday. Your thoughts entering this weekend? Yeah, you know, it's the same type of atmosphere that we want to go into, focusing game by game. Um, tournaments bring a little bit different entity. you got to um, play back-to-back -back matches. Um, it's a little bit more rigorous than we've had the last couple weekends. But I think, again, our confidence is high. Our game is extremely good right now. Um, so the sky's the limit for this team. Patty, good luck to the Falcons this weekend. We'll talk to you next week. And for Falcon Sports, this is Jim Thies. Thanks.